In today's video, I'll be showing you how to unlock the barn in Stardew Valley. We will also be exploring more in the mines and fighting items for the community center. This is part five of our series, and now let's build a barn. Oh, bro. and only a few of you guys are actually subscribed, so a subscribe to the channel would be awesome. Alrighty, let's have a really good day today. Ah, you scared me. Hello, I'm Susan, the owner of the Emerald Farm up at the railroad. I've been trapped up there alone ever since Jojo caused the rock slide, so I've got a little bit of cabin fever. Happy to finally meet you, Grant. Uh, I guess it's good to meet you too. I don't know. Stop by and visit Emerald Farm when you have the time. Uh, sure. We do not care. Scare me as soon as I wake up in the morning. We got something in the mail. This is embarrassing. I lost my lucky purple shorts. I'm telling you because I think I can trust you. Find them, bring them back to me discreetly. I'll pay you well. Thanks, Mayor Lewis. We know where those are at. They're in Marnie's house. Fun fact, if you guys actually take the mayor's shorts and you put them inside of the big soup when the governor's in town, you get a special type of cutscene. If you guys haven't done that, be sure to check that out. It's pretty funny. Alrighty, finally got everything watered. Took a quite a while, so we got that done. Oh, so we got some salmon berry in here and a blackberry. Nice. Alright, we got some stuff we can donate, so let's head into town. Let's go ahead and do that. Grape. Oh, we have a cutscene. I guarantee there's nothing to be worried about, Mayor. But there is. Morris Robin's house was struck by several rocks when the landslide was cleared. Susan was shocked by the blast. She wasn't even informed the operation unit. Everything's under control and we'll be fine, Mayor. And one of the garbage Jojo jumps into the river, Morris. Willie, our local fisherman, says he's catching Joe's CDs and cola cans. Might I remind you, you pursuant to in it R2701 Joja Amendment, Joja's operations here in Stardew Valley are fully compliant with the law. Hello? Hello, Grant. I was just on my way. Good day, Morris. Man, Morris seems like a chump, doesn't he? Joja is paving the way to greatness in Stardew Valley. I bet you are, bro. It's only a matter of time until we are all united under Joja. Yeah, that sounds like a cult to me. Well, that was a pretty interesting cutscene. But let's go back and donate to the community center here. We got some foraging stuff, so that'll be fun to donate. So now we just need a hazelnut and we just finished the summer foraging. Awesome. 30 summer seeds. We'll take it. We're going to have so much stuff to plant and water every morning. We need to upgrade our watering can badly. Oh, cry me a river. So speaking of that, let's go up to the mines and let's try to get some more copper and iron today. I think that'll be really good. We need to get that as much as we can right now early on. All right, let's go down to level 55. Get out of here. All these little zealots are starting to spawn. Stop again, zealots! I got a bomb. That's cool. We just got a jade. Nice and made it to level 60. Got a crystal dagger, nice. Got two cave carrots, cool. Got a frozen tear, we'll take that. All right, not too bad. We're gonna go ahead and leave the mines, but that was pretty good. We got some good loot in there. Yeah, and the next thing we're gonna save up for is definitely a barn. We're definitely gonna need one here. We gotta start getting some more barn animals, like cows and stuff, AKA your mom. Barn! <laughs> All right, really good day. Let's go ahead and put it on the next day. Sweet, we leveled up our combat. We got five more HP and we can make a roots platter. 981 gold, we'll take it. All right, so for the barn, we gotta save up 6,000 gold gold and get a bunch of wood and stone as well. So we're going to start doing that too. But first we're going to get our chores done out of the way and then we're going to head over to Gunther and Clint. We get some geodes opened up and we got some stuff we can donate too. Oh sweet, we got a crayfish from the thing so we can donate that. Alrighty, let's go ahead and head into town. We got some stuff we can donate and stuff. Oh and if you guys are enjoying the video so far, then please leave a like on the video. Let's try to get 20 likes on today's video. It'd be really awesome if you guys did. It helps me grow and it helps me know that you guys enjoy my content. It'd be really grateful if you guys did. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. Okay, so we can donate this crawfish or crayfish to the crab pot bundle. And we just finished that one. Awesome. Oh, we got another crab pot. Three of them. Okay, we'll take that. Definitely comes in handy. Sweet pea. All right, let's go into Clint's and get these geodes opened up. Hey, bud, can you open these up for me? Mr. Beast! Okay. All right. Meatball! Nice. <laughs> Poop. <laughs> All right, not too bad. Thank you. Thank you. Come again. What's up, Gunther? I got some stuff for you. Got a new reward. Okay. What do you got for me, chump? Jade Hills. All right, yeah, we can put that in our house. That's not too bad. That's why this is motel art. We're going to go down to the beach and put some of these crab pots down there. I think that's going to help out quite a bit. Found another lost book. That's nice. But I think I'm going to just spend the rest of the day fishing down here. We need to get some more fish. Got a puffer fish. And our treasure is some more bait. Okay, we'll take it. I know we needed that puffer fish for one of the bundles. Got another puffer fish. Fish. Okay, those things are really hard to catch. Two very boring minutes later. Oh, I got a starfish. I've never seen that before. All right, I'm gonna sell off some of this fish we got. All right, not too bad. But I'm gonna head back to the farm. I need to chop some more trees down. We need to get some of those because we got to start collecting wood and stuff. Sand dollar. That's cool. Hey, Sophia. Please leave me alone. Sophia turns away from you. What's the matter? Thought you were okay. Give you this puffer fish, but I know you'll hate me. You're sweet, thanks. I gave her a salmon berry. <laughs> yeah, we almost got her at two hearts. Not too bad. 
20 minutes later. Alrighty, we got some trees chopped down and some stuff, but we're gonna go ahead and put it on the next day. 986 gold, we'll take it. Alright, the traveling cart's here today, so after we get the chores done, we'll go check that out. Maybe she'll have something we need for the bundles. I doubt that very much. Alright, finally got all the chores done. Let's go ahead and check out and see what uh, the traveling cart might have today. Hello, do you have anything good today? Ooh, large egg, tomato seeds, goat cheese. I, I think we need goat cheese for one of the bundles. I know the large eggs we do, we'll eventually get that, so we don't need to buy that just yet. I am gonna buy one rare seed because we are gonna need that to get another star drop, so we'll just hold on to that for now. But we're gonna go back to the farm. We need to start chopping a lot of trees down. We need to get that wood, so we're gonna go ahead and start doing that. Yeah, this is gonna be a very boring day of just chopping trees, that's for sure. Alrighty, that took long enough, but we got tons of wood. We even did some stones, so that's pretty good. Pretty much just a basic day of doing that, but we needed to get that done. Yeah, we definitely have enough wood now, that's good. Alrighty, really good day. Let's go ahead and put it on the next day. 839 gold, we'll definitely take it. Oh, looks like some of our stuff was done. Okay, cool. I don't care. Ah, uh, yes, we got some large eggs. Awesome. That means we can actually donate these. And our wheat is all done. Perfect. It was perfect. Hopefully we get enough to donate. Yes, we did. Awesome. Yeah, so we got some really good stuff. We're going to head over to the community center and go ahead and donate most of this. All right, so I know we got the puffer fish. We can donate that to the specialty. All right, and then we got some of this crop stuff we can do. Got the animal bundle. Then I believe we donate the wheat over here, if I'm not mistaken. Now we just need three apples. I ate two whole apples. All right, not too bad. Oh, Peter needs a hot pepper. Well, just in luck. I got you one right here, bro. Give me 120 gold. Oh, so you saw the notice I posted? Thank you so much. Let's see. Here's what I owe you. Thank you, chump. Yeah, and we could just sell him the stuff right here and get our money. I'm gonna go down to the beach and see if there's anything down here that we haven't gotten yet. Oh, yeah, we got a lot of stuff in our crab pots. So that's good. And tons of goodies over here, too. Sweet. Oh, there's a fishing spot over here. We'll go ahead and do that. All right, we leveled up our fishing. Not bad. That was really good. Mushroom! Uh, I can't talk to her. She's in there reading a book. Oh, well. I'm trying to level up with Sophia. You know, I got the ultimate Riz, and I'm trying to be nice to her, but oh, well. Stop it. Oh, hello, Elliot. The sun is angry today. My skin is a bit too delicate, I'm afraid. You're scared of the sun? But yeah, let's check out the secret woods. Let's see if we can get anything over here, maybe. What is this? There's like a weird mushroom over here. Poison mushroom. Okay. Oh, look at all this stuff over here. What is this stuff? I have no idea what that stuff is. Red bane berry. Okay. Well, that's a cool little item that they added into the secret woods over here. All right, but pretty good day. Let's go ahead and head back to the farm. All right, we got everything sold off, so let's go ahead and put it on the next day. Level six fishing. We can now make a spinner and a trap bobber. Okay. 2,800 gold. We'll definitely take it. So we got enough money for a barn, we're gonna go ahead and buy one today. We learned how to make baked fish. Okay. Found a chicken statue. Okay. Chicken. Yeah, we're definitely gonna have to upgrade our watering can too. Oh, wow. We got a lot of stuff in here. Some salmon berries, wild plums, blackberries, and a spice berry. Awesome. Cool. We're gonna head up to Robin's. Hopefully she's there and we can get this barn built. Yes, she is here. Hello. I need you to construct a barn for me and we'll put it right there. Sweet. So she'll start working on it. Summer is nice in Stardew Valley. The temperature stays pretty mild. Closer to the Calico Desert, it gets very hot. We're fortunate to catch the sea breeze. Yeah, that's pretty nice then. Found another lost book. You cannot learn from books. But we're gonna go down and see what the traveling cart has here today. But before we do that, we're gonna go ahead and donate some of the stuff in here that we got. So we donated the other large egg. I thought we didn't need it, but I guess we did. So we got that one done. It's hard to make friends around here. The locals don't trust strangers, especially not Joja strangers. Yeah, I remember that in my last playthrough. Bread. Bread. Hello, do you have anything good today, hopefully? Nothing besides the rare seed that we would probably need. Thank you, though. All right, we're gonna go find Sophia and see if she wants to talk to us. I always forget about this little house over here. I always do that. Wonder if she's outside or if she's inside her house. Let's check. Oh, she's actually in town for once. Oh, okay. We'll head back over there. <laughs> she's never in town, so that's killier. Oh, there you are. Hello. Uh, I'm ruining my eyeliner. So sorry. Now isn't a good time. I'm sorry. Here, I got something for you, though. You're sweet. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> 
Yeah, she likes the salmon berries. They're just like normal gifts for her, but we almost have two hearts. Not too bad. See you, Sophia. All right, I got a chicken statue we can donate, so I'll go ahead and do that. Here you go, Buster. New reward. It's a chicken statue, but we don't need that right now. Thank you. I hope Demetrius doesn't blow the house up with those science experiments of his. I don't think he's something of a scientist. You know, I'm something of a scientist myself. Yeah, we can finally go up here to Emerald Farm. Oh, wow. She has a big house. This is so cool. Can't go inside the house or anything like that, like her rooms. I like her house, though. It's really nice. Yeah, so they sort of changed the look up here. It's pretty good. I like it. I keep finding more new stuff every time I play this with the Stardew Valley Expanded mod. A lot of you guys have been asking me that in the questions, what mods I use. I'm more than happy to answer. The big one that you guys see is the Stardew Valley Expanded mod, where it adds all the new players and new locations. It's a really cool mod. You guys should check it out. Alrighty. Pretty basic day. I mean, we got enough stuff to build the barn, so let's go ahead and put it on the next day. 1100 gold? We'll definitely take that. Oh, we got the achievement cowpoke. Oh, we got something in the mail today. Come by the shop and check out the new rods I'm selling. They're the best money you can buy, and you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Hope to see you soon. Willie. Oh, Susan gave me some melons. Oh, okay. Thank you so much. Syrup! Yeah, most of our uh, vegetables are coming in pretty well. We should have a big harvest here in a few days. That'll be really nice. That way we don't have to water as much throughout the day. Oh, a train's passing through. Choo -choo. Too bad we can't get up there in time. I gotta water all this stuff still. <laughs> That's a shame. Alrighty, but I think we're gonna head up to the mines today. We need to start going farther down in them, so we'll head up there and go ahead and do that too. But before I forget, I do have this where we can donate for the exotic foraging, so we'll go ahead and do that. Alright, got that donated. Oh, and if you guys are still watching, feel free to check me out on Discord. I post a lot of stuff on there, and you guys can interact with me and even watch me edit. Also, I do have a merch shop now too, so both the links will be in the description. Be sure to check them out if you guys are interested. Don't tell me what to do. Alrighty, let's see how far we can get down here in the mines. Oh, a ghost dropped a ghost fish. I know we need that for one of the bundles. Awesome. Ooh, got a dwarf scroll. Okay. Got a frozen geo. Nice. Ooh, found a jade. Made it to level 65. Not bad. Got another ghost fish. Wow. Wow. We're having some really good luck today in the mines. I'll tell you that much. Level 69. Nice. Nice. And we made it to level 70. We got a master slingshot. Okay, take that. Not too bad. Ooh, found some amethyst. Nice. All right, we're pretty much out of energy, but man, did we have a really good haul over there. That was fantastic. We got some stuff we needed for the bundles. We got a lot of iron. We got a lot of copper. Not too bad of a day, I'll tell you that much. And we'll go ahead and donate one of these ghost fish as well, because we need that for the bundle. There we go, got that donated. Jody said she wanted a frozen tear. Here you go. Hello, Grant. So you saw the ad I posted? It looks perfect. Let's see, here's what I owe you. 225 gold. I'll definitely take that. Alrighty. Really, really good day. Let's go ahead and put it on the next day. 1300 gold. We'll take it. Looks like we got some stuff done here. Sweet. Robin will be finished with our barn tomorrow, so we'll be able to buy a cow. That'll come in handy. That'll be really nice. Alright, cool. We got some more stuff we can donate, so we'll go ahead and do that. And then we'll head over to Clint's, because we got some GOT can open up it for us. Alright, so we got this sunflower for the dye bundle. That'll be nice. There we go. Got that one in there. Alright, let's go ahead and get these geodes opened up. Hey, can you open these up for me, bud? Okay. <laughs> Really? What the dog doing? All right, not too bad, thank you. Let's go ahead and donate this stuff. Here you go, Buster, you can have this stuff. See a chump. See a chump. So it looks like Sophia's outside. Let's go talk to her. Hey, how you doing? Do you have a pet? I've always wanted one. Yeah, I do have one. I haven't seen Andy in a while. I wonder what he's been up to. This house is still trashed. <laughs> oh, he's down here. He's just screwing around. What's up, dude? I lost two crops this morning to some Yoba darn crows. I need to do something about that. Make a scarecrow, bro. But as you guys can see, it's relatively easy to get a barn. You just need wood and stone and 6,000 gold. 350 wood to be exact and 150 stone. Pretty easy to get all that on the farm to be honest. And the best way to keep chopping down trees is to make field snacks. It's really easy to do early on. I'm gonna go ahead and make another tapper because we need to start getting some oak resin and some pine tar too. It'll be exciting to get some cows tomorrow. It'll be really awesome. Yeah, so we're pretty much out of energy so we'll just go ahead and put it on the next day. Alrighty, let's see how much money we got too. 1,600 gold, we'll definitely take it. We got something in the mail. Tomorrow we're all gathering at the beach for the Annual Pelican Town Luau. Okay, so that means we got to get some stuff to put in there. So we'll just put like one of these grapes or something in there. Yeah, so we got lots of goodies here today. Leveled up our foraging, not bad. But once we're done here, we're going to head straight over to Marnie's because we're going to go buy those cows. That way we can start getting some extra money from milk and stuff like that too. All right, let's head straight down to Marnie's and let's go ahead and get us a cow. Hello, you're finally here for once. I would like a dairy cow, please. 1,500 gold. So this will be our brown cow. We'll name this your mom. <laughs> 
Get another one. First, we gotta buy a milk pail. We need that. All right, and we got a white cow. We'll name it Milky. And we'll get one more cow. We'll name this one Moo Moo. See a chump? Yeah, so not too bad. So we'll be able to start getting some milk here pretty soon from these cows. Probably won't have to feed them too much either because we put all of this hay over by it. So not too bad. Plus, I don't know if you guys know this, but every time you pet your animals, you do get a small amount of XP for farming. So it's always good to do that. So that's also why it's good to have these animals early game on because you get just five XP, but it all eventually adds up. All right, but we're going to spend the rest of the day in the mines. We need to get farther down. I mean, we're getting really good in there, but we still need to get a little bit farther and we have good luck today. So that should help out a lot. Oh, and thank you guys again for all the wonderful suggestions when I say, oh, I wish they had this added or something like that. It definitely helps out a lot. I do look at the mods that you guys suggest and everything like that as well. The only other mod I've recently added was one for the community center. It tells you how to obtain the item or different ways to get it. So like the fishing, instead of having to go on a wiki every time, it tells you, hey, you can get this by fall when it's raining or X, Y, and Z. So pretty cool. All righty, let's go ahead and go down. The next thing we're going to be saving our money up for is to upgrade our tools. So we'll definitely be doing that. No way, guys. I found a diamond. Awesome. Yes. Made it down to level 75. Found lots of iron over here. Hey, don't be throwing your bones at me, bro. I got a bone sword. That's awesome. Yeah, let's try this bone sword out. And we made it to level 80. Firewalker boots. We'll definitely take that. All right, we can finally start getting some gold. gold all in my chain. Red mushroom. Found a ruby. Got another dwarf scroll. Okay. Yeah, this bone sword we got is actually pretty good. But we're going to go ahead and get out of here. Really good day in the mines. That was awesome. We got a lot of good stuff, especially some gold. I think we're going to save this red mushroom for the luau tomorrow. You guys will see what happens when we try to put that in the soup. It's rather funny. Alrighty. Really, really, really good day. Let's go ahead and put it on the next day. So level five foraging. Forester. Trees drop 25% more wood or gather a chance for double harvest to forest items. Let's do trees drop 25% more wood. And then level five mining. Miner, one ore per vein or chance for gems to appear in more pairs. Let's do geologist. 2,600 gold, we'll definitely take it. Alrighty guys, I think this is a great place to end it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I showed you guys how to get a barn. If you guys have never done that before, we earned a lot of money and we we're also able to get pretty far in the mines. But thank you guys again so much for watching. And as always, peace.